Article 17, shall the Town of Hampton vote to raise and appropriate the sum of $131,814 for the following purposes of the Parks and Recreation Department to replace the 22-year-old Kids' Kingdom playground and to replace the tuck field, right field fencing and netting as determined by the Board of Selectmen, the Town Manager and the Director of Parks and Recreation and to authorize the withdrawal of $131,814 from the Recreation Infrastructure Special Revenue Fund established for this purpose under Article 44 of the 2007 Annual Town Meeting Majority Vote required, recommended by the Board of Selectmen 5-0, recommended by the Budget Committee 9-0. Uh, the Finance Department has uh, indicated no tax impact. Is there a motion to open discussion on Article 17? Moved by Mr. Waddell. Is there a second? Seconded by... Anyone? Mr. Griffin, and I recognize our Recreation uh, Director, Diana Mark. Good morning. This article is pretty self-explanatory. However, I just want to give you a little background on this article. This article asks for monies for the Kids' Kingdom Playground in, at, that's at Tuckfield and also for the fencing netting that's at Eaton Park right next to Tuckfield. The Kids Kingdom Playground, which is our biggest and most popular playground in town, was built in 1996. This makes this playground 23 years old today. Playgrounds usually have a life expectancy or a lifespan of 14 years. Our Parks Department has done a great job keeping, up, keeping this playground safe and usable. However, it has come to the point where many replacement parts no longer fit or can't be purchased due to the age of the playground. We are hoping to replace most or all of that playground this year with, the, with a comparable playground with funds from the Recreation Infrastructure Fund. Depending on current pricing, we, are ha we, will have to do, we may have to do a second phase for some of the standalone pieces, which we would try to replace from the same fund at a later date. We also need to replace the right field fencing and netting at Eaton Park. We have done a lot of work to that park since we've acquired it as it is used heavily daily from May through November. Outside of regular maintenance, this is the only major action left to take care of that park. The monies for this item, if passed, will come out of the Recreation Infrastructure Special Revenue Fund and will have no tax impact. So we're hoping for your support on this article. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Martin. Anyone else wishing to be heard on Article 17? Mr. Warburton. Thank you, Mr. Moderator. I rise in support of this article, and it's amazing that it was 22 years ago that many of us in this room spent a rainy weekend uh, building Kids' Kingdom. And as our recreation director has said, uh, you know, over time, these things need to be replaced as long as maintained. I think this is a great article, and I'm glad to see we're doing those improvements. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Warburton. Anyone else wishing to be heard on Article 18, uh, 17? Excuse me. Seeing none, Article 17 will appear on the ballot as printed.